Happy New Year everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Gabriella and I'm so glad that you joined me today. Guys, it's 2023. What the heck? It was literally January 2022 yesterday. And now I'm a whole fiance. I'm getting married this year. I'm moving out this year. Like so much is happening and I just can't believe it. But God is good, that's all I can say. God is so good. Last year was a crazy year, heartbreaking year tough year a lot of lessons a lot of pruning from god i'm so grateful for it because i feel like last year i had to go through all the hardship and all the suffering in order to plant the seeds and now i'm going to reap the harvest this year is a year of harvest okay for all of us this is the year of reaping there's something special about this year and i feel like if we all seek god this year fully wholeheartedly it will be our best year yet i declare that and i speak that over every single one of us watching this right now but that being said let's get straight into this video this coffee is so good. I literally made a galaxy and coffee mocha. But anyway, this vlog is going to be a very exciting vlog because we're going to get our lives together. We're literally going to get our lives together. My room is a mess. Since Christmas, I've not... I think I did tidy once, but Ricky's been in here. Us together, we're making mess. And not like that, though. Not like that. Don't worry. We're until marriage, guys. Calm down. I just mean when we get together, we always throw stuff everywhere so it is literally a mess in here we're gonna clean up we're gonna set up my office downstairs we've got a spare room downstairs which i'm gonna make into my office room my studio room until i move out this year oh my god i'm so excited oh my gosh i can't wait to show you guys the whole wedding planning process the moving out process just everything i'm so excited guys look at my ring look at my ring i'm a fiance i don't know if you knew that already but i'm a fiance <laughs> was a very very lovely time with jesus honestly start your day off with jesus okay this year make it your goal every single day make it your mission every single day to not leave your bedroom without spending time with jesus i know a lot of us have busy routines we have work in the morning but even if you have to wake up half an hour early just to spend that half an hour with god do it honestly i'm a mess when i don't spend time with god i can't function properly honestly and i feel like towards us the the last part of last year I was not prioritizing God as much as I used to before. Um, and I noticed that even if I've spent time with God in, in the nighttime, when you don't start your mornings off with Jesus, things are going to happen and you're not going to be prepared to handle it the right way. Um, so I honestly, I feel, I feel so full right now. And that's the best thing about starting your day off with Jesus because he's going to fill you up so much that whatever happens today, you know that you're filled up with God's word. So you know how to fight. Because how do we fight our battles? With the word of God. So for yourself with the word of God today, I start your day off right by filling yourself up with God's amazing, powerful word. So now that... Oh, I can't even look at my room. Oh my gosh, it's actually making me feel a bit stressed out. But now that we've done our time with Jesus, it's time to attack this. You guys can see all that mess over there. There is literally like... Oh, I just... Guys, I can't stand mess. I actually cannot stand mess. But anyway, I was actually going to do my office downstairs. I do have a spare room. But I'm just thinking, it's so cold down there. It's so noisy down there because it's literally in the middle of the house. I'm just debating, like, I don't know if I want to do it downstairs anymore. 
So I'm thinking of doing it in my room, but I'm working with a really small space because these wardrobes are so annoying to move that I wish if I could, I'd make that into like my office corner, but I don't know where I put these wardrobes. Unless I move them over here. Guys, I don't know. I'm going to sit down. You know, I'm actually going to pray. I'm actually going to ask, ask God to help me find the best way to move my room around. You know what the best thing is? Changing your room around. I don't know what it is, but I, I've changed my room literally like 50 times since I've moved in here. But I just, it is something about moving your room around. It just feels different. It just feels amazing. So I think I'm going to just transform all the rooms. Let me show you guys my room right now. It's literally a mess, but it's okay. I'm gonna clean it. That's my room, the wardrobes, my window, and then boom, my little office table desk. So let's see what I come up with. Hopefully, we'll find a good way to change everything around. <laughs> Update on the room transformation, it is still a mess. But my bed is now here, TV is now there, and I've got a little office space now. I finally have my little office space now. This is like my little journal place where I make all of my journals, my website, my seek journal, my iPad, my schedule for the week, which I need to update. I'm gonna fill it with loads of video ideas. So it's like my little workstation. And then over here we have my main desk with my little, actually this is like a brown old chair. I'll just put like a nice white rug on it. Anyway, this is my main desk where I do all my devotions, spend time with God. So I've got all my books, my Bibles, my devotionals, my notebooks, my Bible, my personal seek journal. I've also got my whiteboard here for all of my videos and stuff. My little corner, all my pens. So that's my cute little office station. And then over here, my workstation. And then coming around to the side, I have my TV with all these boxes. I'll try to make any as possible because I've got a lot in the boxes, but this is what it's looking like. And then obviously I can see my TV from over here, from my bed. I'm really glad I've got a single bed, even though a lot of people prefer double beds. I don't move in my sleep, so I literally stay in one spot. So like single beds are perfect to me for the time being. So this is my little bed, my cute little bed in the corner. It literally fits so perfect in here. And then my mirror, my wardrobes. These are not my wardrobes, by the way. Like I wish I had different ones, but I, can, I didn't get to choose. Um, but then here on the side, I actually made this today. This one as well. Behold, Isaiah Falls 319. I made that one um, at church, but these are like my little prints. And yeah, this is my POV right now of my bed. This one is like. And I'm actually so obsessed, guys. Like changing your room around just changes your mind. It like it literally changes your mindset. It literally makes you so motivated. So I don't know it does, but I just love changing my room. So and the candles as well. I'm gonna make a little canvas as well. With a quote on it. How cute is that from Home Bargains? Anyway, so that is my room. I'm so happy with it. I'm trying to do the heatless curls right now, so I'm looking like a little Victorian lady. But guys, look at my skin. Can you guys just appreciate the glow going on? Because what I've got no makeup on, guys. Like, oh, my eyelashes literally crying for help. <laughs> I have no makeup on whatsoever. My skin looks so good. I can't take myself, I cannot take myself seriously with these curls. So I'm gonna wait till they're done. I'll show you guys the results and I'll be right back. Guys, I look a mess right now. No, don't you dare show my feet to the public when people should be paying. <gasps> what? Can, just... Nobody's paying to watch people to see your feet. For feet. Yeah. So don't be giving it away for free. Your girl looks a mess right now. No, they're so cold. <laughs> so soft and smooth. Very well. Girl is a mess right now. Because, as you can see, cameraman. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Been working, working, working. Non stop working. She is a workaholic. So, yeah, and the work is still not stopped. You gotta, you gotta find that rest, though. Yeah, I did rest today. I fell asleep on you earlier. 
Yeah, you did. Hey, hey, vlog. Hey, vlog. Hair looks nice right now. <laughs> Guys, we both look a mess. Yes, yeah, what it is. But we're a beautiful mess, aren't we? Ooh, yes, we are. Two beautiful messes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what this vlog is about, so I'm excited to watch it myself. <laughs> And um yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. It's basically I'm, getting I'm into getting into twenty twenty three. Oh, is it? Yeah. Let's jump. Head in. Let's dive in. Oh no! Don't do that. Like last time in Spain. What? <laughs> Tell them what happened. Hey, when I when I, Guys, when I hit my head. We went to Spain together like two years ago. Wow, mm. two years ago. Two years ago. And no, we went, no. we got into the swimming pool mm. and he's like, oh, watch, I'm going to dive in the water and like swim to the other end of the pool. Mm. So yeah, he dived into the pool, guys. <sighs> he got to the end of the wall and bashed his head. <sighs> I hit my head. But that's so dangerous because there's a film that that guy, little boy, died from that. Mm -hmm. And it's not just that, like, when I cut my hair now, you can see like a, a triangle on my head. Oh, no, you can't, Ricky. That's why I don't. I, I, no, you I'm can't. You're so oh, silly. <laughs> so I always cut my hair. But yeah guys, just an update. I don't know what the last thing was. I think it was my hair being a mess. The <laughs> results are here, right here. Everything's a mess. <laughs> These are the results right now as you can see on the side of the screen. I forgot to film on, on my vlog, but um, it actually works amazing. I went for $1.99 from Home Bargain, so you should definitely get it. And then now, me and Ricky are about to do the schedule for YouTube. Oops. And I may or may not be going to Brazil this month. By myself. by myself on a solo <laughs> trip so i think i'm gonna vlog that to vlog the experience of like traveling by myself <gasps> to another country well my home country mm. so. you excited i'm very excited ah! but I'm gonna i can't believe you're gonna meet me yeah you're gonna leave me mm. that's yeah, nice see. but we're going to brazil for our honeymoon mm. so <laughs> but yeah, we'll catch up soon. Ciao, ciao, people. Bezu, bezu. <laughs> Hi, everyone. It's been a very emotional few days, I guess, because I think that's why I've not even vlogged anything because I've just been processing a lot. Also, I'm getting married very soon. I'm literally fiancé. I'm getting married so soon. And the thought of getting married and moving out and leaving my home, like, I've lived here for like six years now, leaving my parents, which who I love so much and living with them for six years and then moving out it's a big it's a big thing so like i don't know if anyone can relate to this please let me know like how did you find moving out of your family home and like missing your parents and i don't know i just yeah it's a lot it really is a lot but i'm just trying to process my emotions and just get ready for it because it's gonna happen very soon and i have to be ready because that day will come but other than that i've just been so productive guys like bit tmi too much information but your girl's been on her period okay and god has kept me so much like normally i can't function on my period because of the pain i am just a hormonal mess but this time i don't know what it is but like the pain has just not been hurt as much i mean also get up i've been cooking for my whole family i cooked a bomb meal tonight for my family i'm gonna put a little clip here but it was so good. I should have, I should have vlog, I vlogged it, but I completely forgot to vlog it. But I had a really nice day today. I went out with my mum, my stepdad, went shopping. I got my little backpack there for Brazil. Because I'm not, I'm not going to take a suitcase. I'm just going to go with one backpack for two weeks. Don't know how I'm going to manage. But where I'm going, it's like, you don't need a lot. You really don't need a lot. It's just simple things to get you through the week, so... I'm very excited. I'm so excited to vlog that trip, honestly, and take you guys along with me. But I'm going to end the vlog here because I feel like the more, the longer I leave it, I'm just never gonna get this vlog out. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog of me starting off 2023. I have so many videos planned, guys. Like so many videos. I just have to film them and get them edited and post them because they're gonna be so good. I'm telling you right now, God has given me so many ideas and exciting things happening this year. Like I'm actually going to Brazil. I'm gonna get married. I'm moving out. Like there's so many exciting things to vlog and bring you guys along. So Stay tuned for all of those exciting videos. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to follow me on all my social, which will be down below. Other than that, God bless you and I'll see you all very soon. Mwah.